Welcome to an RMSO news update from the latest photos we have received of Bigfoot, along with the strange and unexplained. Let's start off with this image I affectionately refer to as the Mika Hulk, a strange giant creature captured on trail camera near Tucson, Arizona. The hulking creature was captured on trail camera set 10 feet up and angled down. I will run the image through several light filters while we go over the report from the person that submitted it. BH writes RMSO. This was from my friend's trail camera 10 feet above the ground, looking down into a dry creek bed near Tucson, Arizona. RMSO asks, Were you and your friend able to estimate its height or width from this photo from where the trail camera was positioned? BH continues, Well, the camera was about 10 feet in the air, and he's looking right into the camera. So at least 10 feet tall. Couldn't really guess how wide at the shoulders, but he's a big boy. The next set of images were taken from a car with the handheld camera in the Uinta Mountains of Utah, a place well known for Bigfoot sightings, and the south side where these photos are taken borders the Uinta Basin that is well known for paranormal activity, UAPs, UFOs, and the skinwalker phenomena. Casey writes RMSO with several photos stating, You went to mountains of Utah. RMSO asks, Hi Casey, when were these photos taken, and what part of the vast you went to mountain range? This actually looks like the west side of the road several miles before you get to Moon Lake. Casey continues, Very close to there. It was near Farm Creek, one canyon over from Uenta Canyon. These were taken on January 15th. I think it was trying to act like a tree. My sister took them. RMSO responds. The subject is very strange looking with an almost alien-like posture. A couple of the photos, it appears to have a domed head. Bigfoot is known to freeze to avoid being spotted and depends on its camo. Not sure why it wouldn't just duck behind the ridge line it's walking on top of though. Perhaps it's froze wanting to observe you two in the car. Not sure what it is. I was up that canyon not long ago, and there weren't any statues or log carvings or anything of that sort when I was in there. And we do keep a lookout for wildlife, especially in a Bigfoot sighting hotspot like the Uinta Mountains. I do know that area is also prime skinwalker territory. Not saying that figure is a skinwalker or a Bigfoot. However, it definitely does not look human. Thank you for sending the photos. This next Bigfoot-shaped image was taken from a trail camera in southeast Montana. Keith D. writes RMSO. Good evening, my name is Keith, and I am a member of the Northern Cheyenne Nation. I reside on my reservation here in Lame Deer, Montana. I would like to submit a picture taken on a trail cam of what looks to be a Bigfoot. The owner of the photo is also a member of the tribe. I believe this capture was out on a lease where he keeps his cattle, and the trail cam was set up out near a spring. I would like to know your thoughts on it and what you come up with. Here's the picture. I have enjoyed looking at it. I hope you do too. RMS responds, Hi Keith, really cool capture on the camera. I own about a dozen of the same model. I like the shape of the figure, length of the arms, and the domed head. I am going to run it through several light filters to see if we can pull out any additional details of the Bigfoot-shaped subject. 